What's up, uh, Synth Expert? My name is Alex. I'm with WMD from Denver, Colorado. Um, today I'm going to show you the Architect. It's our newest release module. Um, it's this guy right here. Basically, it is an, arp uh, an arpeggio generator and quantizer module, so you can use it in two ways. You can use the input as a quantizer, or you can hit it with a step input. You can hit it with a gate into there or a clock signal and have it step through voltages um, to make arpeggios. So basically, you can see we've got a keyboard layout here in the LEDs. You can pull up all the notes, and you can see right now we're in C major. Or we can change through different modes to find different scales that we like. We've got Greek modes in there, and some, and then we've got a chromatic male. Very musical. Uh, yeah, chromatic scale, and then we've got some random, um, just like more um, unique scales. So right here, this is our Aeol our Aeolian mode, just a minor scale, and then we've got the notes knob here, where you can just go all the way down to one note. And then you can add different combinations to find different combinations of notes that you want to arpeggiate. So my thing is all about chord shapes. So when you are using arpeggiator in a keyboard, you a lot of times you're just going to arpeggiate through chords, right? So right here we've got our C minor chord. And if we want to go to the major six, we just pop it up. Just one little guy. And then now we've got a um, one little step, and now we have a um, first inversion there. So you can kind of move around and make implied chord shapes. And so if we come up here, we've got four notes. And we can make like a chord here that doesn't have our root note. So we can just drop the root note out, disable that. Now you've got a chord without the root note that's still in the scale. Um, so everything is CV-able. Um, just to show you a little bit what it sounds like, bring it up here. And then I'll uh, play with it a little bit. So I'm playing with the rhythm knobs there, and that's kind of just like skipping incoming gates, it's just getting 16th note gates. So when I turn those knobs, you can make a little bit different of a more of a unique rhythm. You can CV that as well. And then if you just like plug something in like voltage block into the notes, we can now make different um, chords with different steps of the, of the sequence here. So this one takes a little bit of setup pre-hand, um, beforehand, but um, it's a lot of fun to use and especially with like a multi-lane sequencer like voltage block or uh, pressure points, you can get really far in making uh, movement and melodic sequences. So you can have, um, like I said, you can have movement in your music and have um, a little bit more like chord progression feeling stuff. And then we've also got the triad expander module, which just has a one, three, five out for um, um, uh, CVs, but it's not just one, three, five. It's every single um, triad in that scale, and that you would um, actually sequence like separately with a different lane of that sequencer. And so that gives you the ability to use a different chord in your triads than what you're arpeggiating with the arpeggiator. So it's a super fun module, and um, we're really happy to be showing it here, and happy to be here at Knobcon. How much? Uh, that one is 349 and the triad is 99. Thank you very much. Yep, no problem. Thank you.